You're gonna expose me? I'm gonna expose you. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, my name is Juan, and this is my brother. Hello! And today, we're gonna answer some questions that you guys ask. If you ever want to be with a roommate, or have a roommate in the future, potentially, or live with somebody, mm -hmm. we I asked you guys to ask me questions on Instagram of what questions you would have for us. We're gonna bake some cakes. Honestly guys, this is gonna be my first time uh, trying this out. I guess I'm gonna start off with my first question to you. Question? Yeah. So, I okay. Like question. Do we have to watch this or not? Yeah. Coronavirus. Alright, so first question comes from me to you. Uh-huh. So what are three things you disliked about me now that you live with me? Oh, hell no. We're going that in part? <laughs> okay. Start off. Something I don't like about you when you sleep you want me to say it? He's live like this way. <laughs> no, I don't. You Just do tell them. If you're gonna expose me, I'm gonna expose you. <laughs> so, when he goes to sleep, guys, que va vea cuando duerme. Can you translate for me? He drools. That's disgusting. Listen, in my defense, I started drooling only because when I had my braces, I don't know, I feel like it did something to my mouth. And like, ever since then, I don't do it all the time. But oh, yeah. No. That shit's <laughs> wet. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they say things that I don't like. Okay. Second one. Your age. Oh. Uh, second one. He's a bitch. Uh, he always grinning at me for things that I don't do, and that's very annoying because this exactly house, things he doesn't this house, do. Okay, 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 okay. I used to be single, but not single anymore. So I have my have my own rules in my house. So it's like you know whatever. So I just you know pay a lady who fix the room and everything. So. Uh, that's why I don't do shit. Okay, that. The third one is... He doesn't have his license. Wait a damn minute. What? I at least have my permit. Okay, that's one thing you hate about me? Yeah. You hate about me? Really? There is something else. Okay, what, okay. what is it? Oh, he hates my birds. Oh. He always trends them, telling them to shut the fuck up. And You're not even baking your shake. Uh, an alarm, you can shut off and you're like, okay, fine, but these birds won't yeah. shut up. So I'm gonna ask you three things that you love about me. Of course. One is that you're very humble, and I feel like I always knew this about him. Like I knew that he was very nice and humble. Now being here, like I've realized how genuine he is and how helpful he is. He's literally been through thick and thin, and I feel like that's something that I'm gonna be forever great. How many? You are okay. I'm the extra mile. Okay. I feel like I can never repay that because he's already done so much for me just by being here. So, yeah. Another thing that I love about you is that you're so dedicated to your job. Thank because you. I feel like I have never seen somebody so motivated to keep going. Two. And then three, um, I love the fact that whenever I want something or like I feel guilty about it, you just go along with it. So, now we're gonna ask some of the questions that you guys asked us on Instagram. The question is, are you both clean or messy? Oh. Let me get started on that. So, I am pretty much clean. I feel like you guys know that. Well, I mean on... clean or what? In the house or clean your body? No matter what it is, I'm still clean. I like everything to be in place, perfect. Even in my house, back over there, even here. Like, I'm just a clean person because when I see mess, I just get like very anxious and agitated and I start getting mad. So, him, he is the total opposite. Today, he is just like so messy. Everything's everywhere. His shoes. Underwears. His underwear, his, <laughs> his, socks. His, his socks, everything, everything, everything is all over the place. <laughs> I'm the clean one, he's the messy one. If I try sometimes, at least once a year, but I do it. <laughs> <laughs> the next question is, I'm planning on moving out by the end of the year. What's it like having roommates? Honestly, okay. guy, breaks privacy. You don't have no damn privacy, honestly. And, he, I mean, he's my brother, you know, um, but still, the same shit. There is no privacy. But it feels good at the same time because you don't feel lonely. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's when you get cheap shit. Where you got that? The family dog? <laughs> <laughs> Living alone is the best because you have everything on your own. You have everything. You can have your birds, your dogs, everything. <laughs> <laughs> For me, it's hard, you know. For me, it's hard, but I, I'm getting used to it now that he's living soon i'm gonna miss him because the company it, it is great Aww. and it's amazing and i feel more like supporter what does it look like that anyways all right the next question is what are you gonna miss about each other the brother's love that's the only thing i'm gonna miss you miss me 
<laughs> Do you miss me? <laughs> oh, that's not what it is. Are what you talking about the video? Yeah. They I lie? They're alive! <laughs> They're alive! Can I lie? Can I fucking lie? So something that I'm gonna miss about you is my brother, my my beautiful brother is the company. I'm gonna start crying guys and you know I'm very hopeful crying. I cried like a baby. Okay, I think for me one thing I'm gonna miss about you is us laughing and like doing crazy stupid dumb shit. Shit. What's the other question that our fans? Our fans? <laughs> yeah. So I think having a roommate can be either a good thing or a bad thing. It all depends on how you see it and how you are. I feel like having a roommate can be the best thing ever because you know, at the end of the day, whenever you have a rough day or a good day, you're gonna know that you're gonna have a friend there to talk to, or like, if there's something going on, they're gonna be there for you. But I think overall, if you ro roommate with somebody that you know and that you love, it's gonna be like the best thing. I feel like people who were in quarantine with their friends were winning, because I feel like that was the, the, the best thing. Sorry. The best thing you could've done. But yeah, I think that's, that's my answer for that. Okay. So next question is, have you guys fought a lot? I what? Fought? <laughs> you have. <laughs> fought. Like fight. Oh yeah! All the time. Me and him would laugh all the time. We're always laughing and joking around. But now I feel like that we live together, we're always fighting. But we never had like crazy arguments where we don't talk to each other for a long time. No. Maybe um, for like a few It's like hours. for like just a few hours and that's it. But it's not like we just don't talk at all. <laughs> All right, so now we're just gonna pop these in the oven and then we'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back here and we're gonna continue with the questions. So the next question is... <laughs> what? How do you get comfortable pooping around roommates, boyfriend, girlfriend when living together? Pooping? It's kind of weird. <laughs> well, what Juan do is he put music loud. <laughs> <laughs> like, can I hear anything? I hate you. <laughs> what he does, he, he doesn't care. He just goes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't I, care. I've been feeling bad for the toilet. I know, I know. But to answer your question, I guess it's like you just. I feel like you just need to get comfortable with the toilet first, <laughs> and then you get comfortable with the person. Mm -hmm. Okay, next question. It was mm -hmm. dirty clothes. How do you guys throw it in a hamper or leave it on the ground all over the apartment? Okay, well, he leaves his clothes everywhere, literally all over the apartment. So yes, that's him. I like to put it in the hamper and go as I go. Sometimes I do get like lazy and just put it on top of it, but I leave it on top. Oh. Next question, would you guys live together again? Yes, of course. Well, with me, yeah. I don't know about him. Because, I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, I would, but I would put conditions. Like, if it was me and him moving into a house together, yeah. then yes, but I would be very strict on, like, cleaning, organizing, very strict on, like, being clean everywhere all the time. And preferably far apart from each other. Like, our rooms far, far, far apart. <laughs> Next question. Do you guys chill on your free time? Yes, sometimes, yeah, when sometimes, we have time. Yeah, most because of the times we don't have, like, free time, time because the I days that jobs. he works, I work and the days that I work, he works, or sometimes we're like working together. Yeah. You know, when we can, we do chill or like, you know. We go out or we go out. Do you ever feel like you don't want to be with each other? Oh, hell yes. <laughs> well, that was so fast. Uh, because it's true. <laughs> it's like, you know, when you mad. Okay. And okay. You want your person to stay. Okay. I think it's likewise, but it, the way I cope with it is like, I'd rather go out and walk, take a walk because I feel like walks in general just relieves the stress or relieves like the bad energy or what's, whatever what's going on. So yeah, I feel like I do need my personal space sometimes, but it doesn't mean I don't want to be near him or I don't want him with me. Damn, we have different thoughts. <laughs> it's okay, bitch. <laughs> Who sleeps the latest and is that a problem? That's the all you. That's <laughs> all fucking you. He goes to bed late, late. So it is a bad habit of mine, but I'm trying to cut that habit, you know? Uh, again, Lex and last question. Who it? cooks and who cleans? I don't cook and I don't clean, so. That's very accurate. He doesn't cook, he doesn't yeah, clean. Yeah. The way we do it is I think we've agreed that we don't really cook, so that's out of the picture. But like, we usually do takeout or something. But if yeah. we cook, it's like he cooks for himself, I cook for myself. Sometimes we like cook for each other. But as long as you agree and come to terms with something, then I feel like that should work out. Um, I feel like having roommates is like one of the best things you could have, especially in your early 20s or mid 20s or even late 20s. Or who knows, even after like your 
My 30s. 30s, yeah, because it's just something that it's so nice to have because you always have somebody there and they always got your back or, you know, yeah, you might argue and stuff, but they're still there for you. The thing about living with somebody, right? Correct. But I didn't tell you the bad things about it with him because he said Did it, say it? but okay. let's see. The bad things you're gonna say now? Yeah. Oh shit. He what is it? Farts a lot. <laughs> Yo, he's like a I don't know, like a fart machine. He's just like brah, 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 everywhere. <laughs> Yo, it's... bro, I don't get no respect. There honestly. is no respect. One thing that I don't like is that he's super messy. Super messy. But you guys already know that. Like I've so never met is... somebody so no, yeah, but I thought I knew you were messy. Oh. But I never thought you were this messy. Well. Surprises! <laughs> and the last one... Right. He's gonna uh, edit a lot of part of the truth I've been saying about him. Okay, that's gonna be edited. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, spoilers! We're talking, talking, spoilers! Yeah, we're just gonna have a little whip way. Whoop! Let's turn back. Go and take home. Ooh! <laughs> Alright guys, so thank you for watching this video. I hope we answered some of your questions. I think it were most just I like with it. fun, random questions. But these are questions that you guys asked me on Instagram. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. But before we finish, I think we're just going to try out our little cakes that we made. Absolutely. Mm. Mm. I say a 4 out of 10. I think this is too much, but I think it was just the cake itself. It's not yeah. good. It's from yesterday. But once again, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoy. I hope that it was entertaining for you. But once again, thank you for being in the video. I know no it was problem, good for you. No problem, I got uh, so don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and just give it a big thumbs up if you thought this was a great video. And leave a comment on the comment section below. Let me know if you want to see more videos like this, maybe like a truth or drink, a Q&A. On that note, I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Bye. Bye.